When you're racing rockets, how do you know which way is the checker flag? It's a virtual cinch. The track is not a physical track uh, because it's in the sky. Uh, it, we call it a virtual track. The primary augmented reality technology that the pilot sees comes from a company called Elbit Systems, which makes sophisticated helmet mount displays for the military. The capability is extended with some technologies from the Maryland Advanced Development Laboratory, and what's presented to the audiences, in addition to the pilot point of view, is created by ORAD, a leader in broadcast quality augmented reality systems. The rocket racers essentially fly inside this tunnel. That's the track they compete in. The shape of it um, can be uh, infinitely varied from something that's very simple and reminiscent of an automobile racing track, like an oval, or something far more complex that has many, many curves in it and verticals and overlaps and loops and, and uh, portions of the sky for aerobatic flight. As the pilot is flying through the race course, they have this heads-up display and they see in their visor these rings that they have to fly through, which is the course, the three-dimensional race course in the sky. The key to the system is the Targo Racer helmet, which is connected to the X-Racer's instruments and a stream of data that defines the route of the race and draws the boxes that make the virtual tunnel. So essentially what's happening is this helmet is, uh, is uh, spatially aware of where it is in space. It is, it is aware of uh, its position in space and the angle uh, through which the pilot is looking around the uh, cockpit through the windscreen. And depending on what the look angle is, uh, a certain depiction of the raceway will be presented to the pilot, enabling him to competitively race through it. But simply giving the pilots a good view is not enough. Rocket racing fans can watch their favorite flyer go through these wickets, either on jumbotrons, over the web, on TV, or eventually on iPhones, iPads, and the like. The viewer sees the same three-dimensional race course superimposed, we call it augmented reality. It's like the first down line on Monday Night Football. You see that painted in the sky and you see if the rocket racer makes it or doesn't.